Hello and welcome to CJC Adventures. Today we've taken a short trip to a little village town in the Black Country in the West Midlands. We're here in Sedgley. Now Sedgley is just up the road from Dudley. It's only a village town. It's mainly known literally for a bit of industry like most towns or villages were or still are in the Black Country. It's yeah, we've still got a bit of remnants of the past and remnants of, well, basically, a bit of everything if you like. And everywhere has got history. And Sedgley is one of those places in the Black Country where has got plenty of history. It's a rainy day, but that matters not. We're going to take a look at Sedgley. Now Sedgley does have a, one or two shops, there's an Iceland just there, and there's also a Greg's in which me and Craig have just had a lovely sausage roll. I mean the buildings do date back quite a few years here, I mean it is one of those what is on the cusp of, well basically a, a village on a main road. There's one or two gravestones in this park date back to 1879 there's an Asda just at the back of here which they seem to pop up just about everywhere there are of course I mean I like to see lots of remnants from the past who doesn't strange thing about this is a Parkway, and there's is it a cemetery or is it something else? Gooning Griggs. Well, this is part of the town centre. You just see the pub there, the White Horse. It does have a lot of history. I think the Colliers they used to work down the mines. I used to drink there. Former Concord Market. I believe it's shut at the moment. I don't think anyone's bought that. That is actually, by the first look of the building, as you would think, a theatre, a picture house, but no. Second guess, it's a JD Weatherspoons pub. A former theatre, cinema, and has even kept the name. Not many places would turn a theatre into a pub. Well, that's what you see right there. The Clifton. Never been in, but that is actually what it is. A pub. There are other pubs in Sedgley, one of them being the Swan. This actually used to be a pub. It was called the Courthouse. Just remnants now. It's to me like it's someone's house now. Very old type looking. Bilston. Two miles, three miles. Mm -hmm. 
Now as you can tell this is All Saints Church here in Sedgley. It does date back to the around about 1070, 1071 but the actual church what was here before dates back to that era but there's always been a church here. This dates back to the early 1900s. It is a nice church. Don't think we'll get in here today because of well, it's closed anyway, but I imagine it's because of COVID restrictions. But lovely church. We're going to take a little walk around it now. What dates are? Eighteen fifty-three. Yeah. A long time ago. Ah, oh, like a, like a monument or the real. God. Sacred. Says that on most of them, then, do you? Sacred. Perhaps one of the call it the sacred church, eh? Sacred Heart Church. Yeah. It dates back to the 1900s, this does. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Weird, eh, them? Yeah. They look very happy with their ears. Is that one there? <laughs> I don't see. <laughs> No, they are kings and queens, eh? Yeah. What's that symbolise this summit when they've got faces on churches? Yeah. Symbolise this summit, I imagine. Oh, I think we we'll do, yeah. stained glass windows No Where is flowers on that grave there? Eh? Hey, do what? Where is it? A cellar? Might be a tomb, isn't it? Okay. Perhaps that's where they deliver the beer. <laughs> well, why <laughs> <are> you? <laughs> yeah. And there is some uh, flowers around here. One of the graves. <laughs> so they just leave them just for. I don't think they're actually for the graves. Pretty new. Oh, new graves here. This is where things go downhill, if you know what I mean. Notice them chimneys twisted. Somebody's twisted them. It's weird. Just over the back there, you can see the big pipe coming up over the hedge. That is the actual Bagridge Colliery. That is a remnant of the past. As you can see, farmland as far as the eye can see. I imagine that all of this road at some point over the years was actually dug through the hills. As you can see all the remnants of the rocks and then they've built up parts of the wall to keep up structures so yeah. this is actually Gospel End Village on the outskirts of 
Sedgley. They always seem to keep the Christmas decorations up on there. All year round. Yeah. I don't know why, yeah. Summer house. Yeah. Yeah. Tie up until the summer though, as the sign says. Yeah. It's open, but I think it's open like certain times of the day, I don't know. Yeah. Well we've made it to Bagridge. Country Park, former Bagridge Colliery, and let's just take a look. You know, this might look below Crystal Lake, you know. Somebody come running out the woods at you. It's a nature reserve as well, eh? You know, the one thing you don't want to do is yeah. walk across there. Don't walk across there. Uh, walk across Cray. Should I stop the cows from getting out? <gasps> hey! Did it! That's the old colliery, that's the only remnants left eh, by the look of you. And that's, that's when it was a colliery. It's a country park now. Where, uh, that was open in the 1800s. But I don't think they actually know what the exact date was when it opened. But it closed in 1968. And it was the last pit in the black country to be closed. That was the last surviving one. And when it opened as um, Bagridge uh, County Park, Country Park, um, Princess Anne opened it in 1983. Um, well, we're begun in 1981, and it took till 1983 to get everything right, and they've just left the remnants of what used to be, here, which is obviously the Bagridge Colliery Pit, oh, and that, that was a uh, the big chimney to it and part of it are. I'm going to say it was Princess Anne then. I opened it in 1993. Well, this was the baggage colliery. As it says, coal mining started here at Bagridge in 1902 and continued until 1968 at the height of production. It employed over 3,000 people, and that, that's what it looked like. That's what this was all like. That was the chimney we saw earlier. What a dangerous job to have. Who knows? I imagine that was part of um, a rail for, for when this was the uh, for when there was where the mine was. Eh? Look, that's one of the cars. Eh? It's got 82 stamped on it. Yeah, that must be one of the actual real rails. Oh. Yeah. And them and the sculptures of the men. Looks like something off Indiana Jones, eh? you know, that's a cart, eh? you know, but... Oh. Imagine getting up to, um, to work to come here every day and go underground and 
dig for coal and risk your life every day, don't know if you're going to come home or not. I suppose I was bothered then, was there? Yeah, I'm just I think a danger. Yeah. Yeah. This is butterflies, aren't they? Oh. That was where they used to dig for all the coal up there. That's where they'd send all the trucks up. Is it? I say there's still remnants here. Though. The river goes too low. I believe so, it's all uh, naturally there. I believe so. I wonder how long that bridge has been there. You need to break so it might be a footway, isn't it? This is the bag pool then. The piano bridge. You probably see beds you else see around here, like other places, because they're like swamp. Kind of. Nah, refrain from it, don't they? Beautiful place, eh? Oh, be surprised at what the countryside we've got here, wouldn't you? You know, it's untouched. There's a fish in there. Might be in there. Fish in there. Very twang. tranquil. 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 Yeah. Say the word. Do not throw rocks into the pool. Throw a rock in the pool then. <laughs> I'll throw rocks in the pool, Craig. Naughty that is. Oh, oh, oh. What's up? What's wrong? It might be twin, then, not it, with Crystal Lake? Oh, yeah, I'll take them on. Oh, 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 yeah. Coming back up the creepy bridge. On the way back. No sign of Jason. Expect it to be. I imagine this was like the materials that they used to use, worry. She, she got like the coal. Yeah. It's like a sun they use. It's gravel. That's stewing. No gravel. Please keep off the railway. Shall I walk over the railway? <laughs> Yeah, you think about how dangerous that job was, and oh, yeah, yeah. you know, if 
think about the lawyers what was lost. One or two ghosts on there, are we? Yeah. There's somebody's living, making a, a lot of money out on it, all that, I suppose. Oh, well, yeah. Oh, I think we should have left some breadcrumbs there to get back. Oh, I've been no idea. What do you think? It's really, 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 really steep. As I'm saying it, I think it's just starting to rain. Of course it's on there. Of course it's on Yeah, why? Why? Because it's Bob's bench. Yeah. You know, who, who, who is this Bob? Is his name the bench after him? Robert's bench. <laughs> Bobby bench. Mm. <laughs> yeah. mm. It does actually say there, danger, health risk, no bathing. But would you really want to bathe in there? Not me now. Even on a warm day, I wouldn't. I'll pass. Thank you for watching CJC Adventures on this trip round Sedgley and the Bagridge Colliery. Now, Country Park. <laughs> Colliery, Country Park. Please subscribe, please like this video, and thank you to all that watch and subscribe. We'll see you again soon, and see you next time. Take care.